A man, an animal, who has done it all at WWE. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the WWE Champion, the Animal Batista! The Animal has conquered countless iconic heroes in WWE. And Batista, he doesn't fear any being. No fear, no trepidation, all focus. Yeah, add to that, Corey, Batista's frightening presence and overwhelming intensity. Brutality awaits. A vicious battle for survival is about to begin. Batista may be the valedictorian of the School of Hard Knocks from childhood all the way to WWE. Yeah, but you could say Batista's time as a member of Evolution really created the DNA for the animal. His intimidation factors off the charts. He just pummels you with brute force. Yeah, nothing more dangerous, hungry, and aggressive than the animal Batista. The Viper has arrived. And his opponent from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 245 pounds, Randy Orton. The Viper won his first WWE Championship at the age of 24, the youngest world champion in history. Such an accomplished career for this young man. But gentlemen, we know that the Viper is at his best when he hunts alone. Methodical, dangerous Randy Orton has earned his spot at the top of WWE. He has beaten nearly every big name, slain nearly every legend. You gotta wonder, what's next for the Viper? Championship, Saxton, and plenty of them. Dating back to their days in Evolution, there's always been a rivalry between Batista and Randy Orton, especially when you think about how Orton was removed from the group. And rightfully so, Cole. Orton will never forget how Batista carried... A bear hug, squeezing the breath out of them. Bear hug. Well-placed elbow. We'll get you out of it. That might be enough. Yes, it is. Close line. Slam. For the win! Shoulder shoots up before two. If that won't beat him up. Probably not gonna win for a couple hundred years, Byron. You know why? Because the Billy Goat's curse is in effect. Oh, I can't wait to break the curse. Boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. 
Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. You got to think Orton and Batista know each other so well, Corey. Trained together, teamed together. They definitely know each other's strengths. That they do, Cole. But the experience edge goes to the Viper. Randy's been in that ring week in, week out for two decades. Batista's sabbaticals have robbed him of the reps you need to match Orton's in-ring IQ. Going right after the neck. Neck breaker. The Viper is facing a bit of danger here. This can't be how Randy Orton envisioned this match going. Great strength being shown here. Oh my goodness. Reversal, can they go on the attack? Ugh, gets put into the barricade. Face first into the barricade. These are dangerous attacks on their own, but now the damage is exponentially multiplying. Stop in the leg. And Orton finding himself on the wrong side of some offense there. The animal's been grinding his teeth all night, and that was an indication that he's ready to feast now. Oh, kick right to the gut. Another and another one. one. Close line. Nice combo. Driven into the barricade. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. He climbs back into the ring just in time. That was getting close. Spidebuster by Batista. Two. Yeah, no. He doesn't get the three. What do you have to do to put this guy away? Suplex. Into There's the, the cover. He breaks the ref's count after one. Wow. Pulls their opponent in. Belly to belly. Producing consecutive attacks. This is frightening strength here. Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could be four. here all day. Power. I think you're right. Rotating vertical suplex. Nicely done. Right to the face. Here he goes for the win. Almost ended it there. A long two and a half in the waning moments of this match. Oh, what a close line. Not finished just yet. And another. Adding insult to injury a third time. Batista is out of his cage. The animal's on a rampage, and Orton has nowhere to go. Randy Orton gets him back. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Oh. Oh. Batista looks knocked out. Is it enough? The cover! And they're still in this. If Batista just survived the best shot he's going to receive all night, I don't think there's any stopping the animal. Orton is going to have to keep his composure moving forward. He thought he'd put him down with that one, and now he's got to think of another way. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. Oh, a debilitating elbow drop. He's in a little bit of trouble now. That's just Orton doing what he does best and letting him know he's not going anywhere. It doesn't matter how big Batista is, the legend killer puts everyone down with that. Orton's not going to do this. Orton's not going to do this. Able to parry that one. The sadistic. Batista with a patent. With a Batista bomb. Batista didn't waste time. Makes the cover. He stays alive. He stays alive. Orton can't be happy that he was almost down for the count, and we all know what happens when the Viper's not happy. Not many people escape defeat after Batista gets hold of him. Got him set up. This could be it, Corey. Batista bomb! Somehow, Orton is down. Two. Kick out. I thought it was finished off for sure. Talk about a close count. 
but the Viper is still up high. Splash! This arena has come unglued. You can feel the foundation shifting with every turn in the match. Climbs back inside. Getting him into the corner. Boom! What a right! Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. Turns it around. Sole of the foot meets the stomach. Batista sidesteps it. To the face. What a redirect. Hoist it up, into the snap, suplex. Viper in full control. Ooh, launches. Set up for the side rushing leg sweep. Pulls their opponent in, belly to belly. Randy Orton feeding off this electric crowd. Oh, stomp it away. And Orton gets countered there. The animal is fired up as he'll ever be. That's a good way to make your presence felt. And Batista really looks battered after that attack. But a cornered animal is still just as dangerous. Well placed, kick to the gut. Another damaging Bang. kick. Slide. Nice combo. And now Batista's being dismantled. Orton cutting Batista off. The animal's got to be wounded. Be kidding me. Oh, no. Devastating attack from the Viper. Looking for the victory. He manages to kick out. What strength. Amazing. The animal refusing to stay down for the count. Well, Batista was down, but as we just saw, he's definitely not out. And Orton definitely thought that would be a three count, but he can't let his frustration get the better of him. Batista! Batista bomb! You can't take any more of that. This must be it's over. The cover! And the victory! Here is your winner, the animal, Batista! Batista has come out on top against the Viper. Before this match starts, maybe some good sportsmanship. Yeah, maybe that's asking uh, maybe oh, too much. Oh. That's how you escalate the disrespect. Hey, maybe they shouldn't have taken the bait, right? It's all about trying to embarrass this superstar's opponent in the early going. Well, this match is underway, but as we just saw, there's clearly a lack of respect between these superstars. It takes real toughness to climb into the ring after taking a few hits. It shows how much this match means to everyone involved. Well, I don't think that's a choice they should have had to have made in the first place. It's totally unfair. It could dramatically affect the final outcome of this contest. Only time will tell. Targeting the throat there. Uh-oh. Well-placed elbow to the leg. What the leg? 
Look at this. He just tossed the leg. I don't think people realize the amount of strength it takes to hurl someone like that. Whipped over in a snap suplex. Rikishi, top turnbuckle. From the top. What? And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. How can an opponent even hope to topple a big man of Rikishi's unique size and physicality? You've got to try to leverage Rikishi's 400-plus pound frame against him. Attack his lower half constantly. The harder you make it for Rikishi to stay standing, the easier it'll be. To Perfect time to attack when his guard is down. Sight set on the top rope. From the top. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, he's going for the pin. This could be it. Oh. And he fights it off. That is just pure instinct at this point. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Knee right to the gut. Savage knee to the face. Things have been building to a head for some time here as this feud has only continued to grow. Yeah, the rift between these superstars is pretty substantial at this point. That means there's no turning back now. Only way to settle things is in the ring. And the cover for the win. This is it. Got it. No, just a two. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. And another counter. Getting carried. Unsure what they're thinking. Ooh, that's how you dominate your opponent. Pulls their opponent in. Belly to belly. Cover. There's two. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. Caught him right in the jaw. Oh, what a shot. Oh, he fights Rikishi back. Right to the kidneys from behind. Big right hand connects. Incoming. Drive by. Can Rikishi come back from that? Pin. And a win. That may be one of the biggest wins of his career. Here is your winner, MVP. Man, I was really hoping they'd shut them up here. Credit where credit's due when it comes to the victory, but it seems their disrespectful ways will unfortunately remain intact. And Cole, you were so up in arms about the earlier disrespect they showed, but look at them now. They were clearly in the right. Corey, this doesn't necessarily suggest they were right. Look, they gave their opponent the chance to prove them wrong, and it didn't happen. No disrespect. Who's here? The People's Champion! The Brahma Bull looks ready to lay the smackdown. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Miami, Florida. Weighing in at 265 pounds. The Rock! Well, here's a man who's captured the imagination of the entire sports entertainment industry, the Brahma Bull, one of the very best of all time. Without question, The Rock has been a champion at every level. Hey, Saxton, your role, know it. Your mouth, shut it. That wasn't very nice.
We're about to see The Rock lay the smack down. All the catchphrases aside, The Rock is all business tonight. <laughs> the Rock holding court inside the people's ring. And his opponent from Cameron, North Carolina, weighing in at 236 pounds, Matt Corby. The feeling, the electricity in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt in quite some time. This match is going to be good. Oh, this person better be ready to go because he's going toe-to-toe -to -toe with one of the all-time greats, The Rock. Funny games, clearly not on his mind here tonight. He's got one focus in this matchup here, and that's to secure the win at any cost. And he'll be facing off against The Rock. If Rock was half the size he was, he'd still be an intimidating man. Ha! And he'd still be bigger than Michael. Nice suplex. Vertical suplex. Look at this. Oh, and a backbreaker! Right to the spine. What a barrage of stops. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. Launching. Ah, oh, straight to the floor. Taking a chance, and it didn't pay off at all. Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This feels so unsafe. Thrown back in under the ropes. Now. Oh, put down face first. He turns it around. Into the corner. This can't be good. Rock with the arm clutch into the boom. DDT. We got a cover. And a kick out at only one. That's smart. Taking the one to catch your breath. Oh, look at I mean, beat the hell out of this guy. This is ridiculous. Can somebody stop this? Well, this oh. might have been the savior we were looking for. Here he comes. Where is he? That superstar is in the head of the up. Uh-oh. Twist of faith! The Rock just got checked in. Two! He kicked out of two. The Rock stays alive. What resilience from the people's champion. And it may just take going to the well one more time with that maneuver to gain the pinfall. No! Cross body! Whoa! Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Float over into the DDT. The Rock saw that one coming. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. That's a bad landing. I wonder if he can smell what The Rock is cooking. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. How 
got it. Scott. The Rock setting him up for oh, the Rock got all of it. Cover. Two. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole, his opponent included. That usually finishes most men. The Rock has to be frustrated not getting the fall. Uh-oh, look at this! Slingshot! Powerbomb! For the win! He breaks the ref's count before two. All the punishment he's taken, and yet he's still in this match? And the DDT! Textbook side headlock takeover. Tremendous pressure on the head and neck. Climbing up to the top now. To the sky. Diving leg drop from the top rope. Discouraging situation for the people's champion. The Rock is not looking good here. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Ooh. The superstar is digging down deep. This superstar giving themselves a major chance. And there's the cover. Kicking out in time. How? How? Up fast. Fine, Buster. Down hard. That's the kind of fuck will it be? No, he gets the shoulder up. I didn't think we'd see a kick out there. Counter by The Rock. Boom, what a... Uh-oh. About to hit. Rock bottom. Rock got it. I think it's over. Looking for the victory. Two. And The Rock picks up the win. Here is your winner. The Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, despite the earlier distraction, they were able to focus and keep their eyes on the prize. The odds were stacked against them, but they are standing tall now. Yeah, but they shouldn't expect the same results each time. They got lucky here. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 230 pounds, Paul. The moment this match was announced, the WWE Universe has expected a classic. I think it is destined to deliver.
A competitor with his share of detractors, but he wants to prove them all wrong here tonight. The gold standard of WWE. And his opponent from Orangeburg, South Carolina, weighing in at 248 pounds, Shelton Benjamin. To look at Shelton Benjamin's success, you have to look at his past. I mean, Benjamin trained in the same class as the likes of John Cena, Brock Lesnar, Randy Orton, and Batista. Get ready for a world-class education from a master class athlete. Yeah, and Shelton Benjamin is constantly evolving. Always happy to remind the WWE Universe just who the heck he is. And here we have a superstar with a big chip on his shoulder. He has certainly felt overlooked recently. Well, he has a chance to change that perception in this matchup. But he'll be in for a long... Hold on a second. He might be finding a submission hold here. And the rope forces the break. Great effort, though. Evades their offense. Big punch finds its mark. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. Sharp elbow to the gut turns that one around. Caught with a punch. Oh, using the rope to their advantage. Attacking the arm. Shoulder tackle. Shot after shot, then slamming their face down. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. And Shelton perhaps struggling to match his opponent's speed. Ushiguroshi! Letting his opponent know he can take on the world right now. What are the keys to victory for Shelton Benjamin here tonight? Shelton really can do it all, but his power and technique have always been key. This guy trained with Brock Lesnar in college and was mentored by the Hall of Famer Kurt Angle earlier in his WWE career. That's where his bread's butter. Superman punch! Oh, look out! And the spear! Does Shelton have some fight left? Over! What a win! for this superstar. An incredible matchup, highly competitive. And this superstar certainly earned the right to be the victor. Oh, whoa. got a steel chair. Come Way on. Your opponent out. This is too far. A statement made tonight. And here comes one of my favorites. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Aberdeen, Washington, weighing in at 212 pounds, Daniel Bryan. The incredible accomplishments, the storied feats of strength, the pure talent of this individual is just astonishing. Wait, did they write that down for you to read on air? Like, it sounds exactly like what I heard them saying in the mirror backstage.
A fight against the ultimate opportunist is the ultimate opportunity. I hope this superstar doesn't crumble under the magnitude of the opportunity. And here comes the multi-time world champion. by Lita from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 250 pounds, Edge! You know, Edge has won and cashed in the very first Money in the Bank contract, and he's found so many unique ways to win. He is truly the ultimate opportunist. Now, this is a superstar coming into this one with a major chip on his shoulder. Feels like he's not gotten the respect from the division that he's deserved lately. Yeah, but respect has to be earned in matches like this, not just handed out. If he can prove himself here, maybe he will get the respect he believes he deserves. Gonna have to dig down deep here tonight. We'll see what Edge has in store for him tonight. I can't imagine what sort of things Edge has already cooked up in that twisted mind of his. Yeah, Corey, sometimes it scares me how far Edge is willing to take things. We've seen how quickly Edge can snap and lose all regard for safety. What's he planning here? Back first. He can end it here. He's got him. And a strong kick out in one. Still not enough to put him away. And Edge seemed caught off guard by what his opponent had in store for him. This is just brute power. Release German. Edge is certainly fighting from behind now. Edge keeps getting cut off at the pass. Edge thwarting away the attack. Edge looking to put the... Stepping things up a little bit. This yeah. superstar starting to build. Here it comes. Strike after strike, blow after blow. Ooh. Arm ringer applied. Down for a European arm breaker. Oh. Just picking him apart now. Here's the cover for the win. Rope break. Pin stops. This is getting intense. Someone check on Saxton. Ooh. And Edge getting jammed up there. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. the hammer right on the lower back point of the elbow nailed it and edge is countered wow what an arm drag edge cannot avoid this really just laying it in Measuring his opponent. Counters. This could be an opportunity. Saw it coming. Oh, man. Spine-crushing impact. Oh, yeah. my God. What an elbow. What a forearm. Tied up between the ropes. It's about to get worse. Look at these knee strikes. Looks like that opened Edge right up. 
And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. He turns it around. Has the arm into a hammerlock since did arm breaker. Ah. And he tosses him back in now. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Oof. Had it scout. Here's Edge's big chance. Shoulder up before three. I don't know how he just kicked out, and I'll tell you what, I don't really think he knows either. Edge stopped just short of that mountaintop he talks about. Gonna have to make a harder push to finish things off. And now Edge is close to that scary place, close to having... Sizing his opponent up. Here he comes. Edge with a spear. Edge could end it there. Shoulders down. Are we sure that wasn't three? Uh, just about as close as you can get. It doesn't get much closer to a three count, and Edge knows it. The opportunistic Edge knows it. Oh, slingshot sent time. That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. You can begin to see it in these superstars' faces. Exhaustion is beginning to set in. They're starting to breathe heavier. This is the time where matches are won and lost. Taking this outside. This could be good. Nice suplex. Uh, grabbing the arms and just rapid stops. The stomp in every single part of his body. And now gets tossed into the ring. Roundhouse kick. Ooh. Stopping their opponent. Boys and ready. Oh, the knee strike! Terrible position for Edge. That's gotta be it. Two. Somehow he kicked out. That veteran instinct of Edge on display there, digging deep into the reserves to kick. Measuring his opponent. The knee connects. How do you come back from that? is finally over. Here is your winner, Daniel Bryan. End of this match with a big win under his belt. This match is why his name is mentioned when superstars get asked about dream matches. Just an unbelievable performance he had tonight, Corey. The WWE Universe just exploded! The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Wichita Falls, Texas. Weighing in at 343 pounds, Keith Lee. If you listen to After the Bell this week, you know this is a match I've wanted to see for quite some time, and it's almost time to start.
The look of focus and determination on his face. He wants to show the world that he can compete on this high level. One of the best superstars around. And his opponent from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 237 pounds, the superstar. You want to talk about someone who will do whatever it takes to get the W? Well, you're looking at them right now. And why do you say that like it's a bad thing? If you're not doing whatever it takes to win, maybe you don't belong in WWE. And here's a superstar that has all the tools to be one of the biggest names this business has ever seen. I'm not ready to crown him as the next big thing just yet, but his performance in this match could sway me. You're not the only person to be looking to convince tonight. Though his opponent will have something to say about that. He himself has garnered a lot of experience and knows in this business you're either stepping up or being stepped on. He's one step ahead there. Belly to belly suplex. Boom, what a kick. Hip drop. I've been waiting to see that. And just like that, he said crashing to the floor. Boom, him all you want. He's just feeding off it more. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. He's burying elbows in the midsection. He moves just in time. Nice takedown. Oh, headlock takeover. The better part of Valor. He'll head to the ring. to the gut. Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? Expertly applied triangle. Oh, no, this is... Able to free himself of the triangle. Oh, kick right to the back. There's a double leg drop. He's lost some of his win now. Oh, black jet. Gosh, landing face first. Punch right in the head. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Utilizing the top rope to inflict more punishment. Oh, man. Draped over the top rope. Shutting that down with the back elbow. Close line. And he cuts bait, slipping out of the ring. Shut up, Saxton. This is just a small regrouping. Overhead, belly to belly. Oh, my God. He's just taking a moment to simply remind everyone why he's simply the best. He is truly feeling it right now, as well he should. 
I think the crowd knows what we're about to see. On the power bomb. My goodness. Leave the nightlight on for him. It's over. Where in the world is he getting this from? His beating heart will not be stopped. I can't tell if it's anger in the eyes of the fact that he hasn't finished this or if it's disbelief that his opponent is still in this. Knee right to the gut. No. Slingshot sent on to the outside. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Curling your own body like that is insane. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right to the face. My God. Boom! A forearm smash. He's absorbing some tough hits now. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. Off the barricade! Oh, and a stomp! Oh, right to the kidneys! Golly! And just a high proficiency of attacks from him now. This could be his moment! Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Just pounding away! Enough already! He's hooked up! German suplex! Thrown back in under the ropes. He went right into that turnbuckle. Dangerous spot for him to be in. Uh-oh. Oh, and what a right! Now ascending to the middle rope. This is gonna be bad! Angle slam! You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Ankle lock, ankle lock, ankle lock. You don't want to get caught in this. Oh, this one's over. He needs to find an escape route. Nice. Blues line. Through the clothesline. Good God, man. Jeez, Lou. For the win. Breaks the count. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. What a blow. Carefully measured right. A little oh. insult to your injury. Ooh, sharp kick. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. Shot to the gut will break things up. Critical time in this matchup. This is a time to dig deep. Oh no, getting in position. What's he planning to do here? Oh, the ankle locks in. Oh, and he's able to find enough grip to fight out of the hole. Crucial escape here. Set up for a second time. Pop up power bomb. My goodness. It's all over but the count. What? Only two? It was almost all over. Almost a three count. Yeah, talk about a close call. It is unreal that this match is still going on after a maneuver that would end most matches. Straight impact on the throat. And now he's on the downside. He's got to reevaluate his approach at this point. There's electricity running through this arena right now. Will it be the spark for one of these competitors? Oh, and soon we could be seeing a submission here. Impressive display of power. Oh, tap out! That's it. The blood and sweat put into this match. Well worth it. Here is your winner, the Superstar. 
You cannot say they didn't give it their all and then some to achieve this victory. After this win, you cannot question the heart and determination of this superstar. Well said, Byron. I don't think anyone will be questioning that from now on. Pacing in the ring, waiting for his opponent. High stakes matchup. You can feel the intensity here. Here we go. He is wasting no time dropping bombs on his opponent. Man, what a wild start to this matchup. Are you surprised? Well, a great way to start this matchup. The WWE fans in for a treat. A smart way to give yourself an early advantage in this match. After a shotgun attack during the entrances, this match has found its way inside the ring at last. Now we can really get things started. And you know what? I respect the decision to still go through with this match after an attack like that. I'm not sure whether I think they're brave or foolish, but it does take guts. Oh. Capped off with a big one. Turning the tables. Just squashing their opponent. Placed into the corner. Oh, my God. A superstar like Kevin Owens, he's as crafty as they come. That's got to be his game plan, Corey. He's also surprisingly athletic, which is something to keep in mind when you're up against. So he might have the mental and physical edge here. In the end, it might just come down to resilience. His shirts may say, fight Owens, fight, but he... And he goes for the pin. He's on the ropes, and the rep wisely stops the count. Oh, moonsault. Incredible agility. Look at him totally vibing with the WWE Universe right now. One arm hooked. Face buster. Looking for the victory. Two. Kicks out. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. He's absorbed some damage already. Evades the attack. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. <laughs> Bang! Vicious boot. He just won't give up. Picture perfect drop kick. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Connecting on the DDT. Oh, red right in there. You feel that in the air? There's a deeply personal rivalry at play here, and it's making the whole arena feel electric right now. You're right. It's incredible how the emotions of the competitors can dramatically alter the mood here. This one is headed outside, guys. Just a step ahead of Owens. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Three. Off the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? From the top. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, this is it. One, two, Got him now and a kick what? out by KO. That sucked all the air out of this place. It looked like a done deal. Owens is vulnerable. Oh, stop. 
that's a lot of blood starting to pour from Owen's head. That's Cover. it. I think KO might be out. He's still in this fight. Owen's showing that he didn't come here to be beat. He's here for a fight. Everything possible was done to win there, but it just fell short. Owens intercepts it. Oh, my God. Right over the top and hit hard. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Oh, sent flying. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. Able to reverse that one. Owens looking for the Kevin yeah, Owens pop up power bomb. And Owens might just have this. Two. Oh, not yet. They just got the shoulder up. Within inches of victory, only to have it snatched away. This match just keeps getting more and more exciting. Owens has ended so many matches with that, but not today. These superstars have endured so much punishment. Certainly looking worse for wear, but the tide can shift at any moment. KO. Fall away, package, power bomb. Stun, Owens, stun. Owens got all of it. Shoulders down. No, he beats the count. Wow, looks like this book has a couple more chapters in it. We might be seeing a whole saga written tonight. And you have to think that famous temper of Owens is starting to rise. The question is, can he stay out of his own head? Ooh, merciless looking blow. Gosh, what a match. Oh, look out. Missile drop kick. Just could do it. Finally ends it in all the bloodshed. Perhaps worth it now. Here is your winner, Kevin Owens. A win worth celebrating tonight. None of these competitors were giving an inch in this one. Just goes to show that breaking the rules doesn't always pay off. No rules were broken, Saxton, but it was almost worth the risk if you ask me. I thought they almost had them.